Hey there, and welcome back to part two of my comparison between Light Yagami and Lelouch Lampereuse. Well, now that we've got done talking about some of the uh, more similarities between them, or, well, this is well, discussing that the uh, only similarities between them are just their intelligence and their ability to control people, or power to control people, because they're, what they use is different, but still, they do have the power to control people. Now let's talk about some of the more differences. But huh? now I could go for I could go for hours talking about their characters and such. But you know, and the term <clears throat> and basically what they what they do, you know, in order to go about it. But you know, I'd rather go and talk about their goals because that's what that's the big thing when it comes to these two is their goals. And their goals, while sounding kind of similar, are still quite different. For one thing, Light wants to... Now, they both want to create a... Now, both Light and Lelouch want to create a new world. You know. One that's kind of peaceful and all that. But the big difference is that Light kind of goes around... Goes about it almost like a dictator. You know, he wants to only... Only wants, you know, good, you know, hard-working people, you know, to be in it. You know. Just wants... Just the purest kind of people. And just that any criminal, you know, be they, you know be they big or small small time they should all die you know they should all just die that in his, in his eyes you know he just wants a perfect world and just in every way a nice goal I guess you know, by the way you know it's nice to wish it but oh it's not about a nice goal you know it's just it's nice to wish it you know but the way he goes about it is just very unethical, you know. He's going off killing people, you know. And I understand he's killing criminals, and which I can understand being a that's a that's a good thing, you know. You know, I don't I don't know about them being those small time crooks, but you know, but big time criminals, yeah, I can understand him killing them, you know. Because if you know, if I had a death note, I'd definitely kill every rapist, you know, out there. But. When he kind of go, but when he goes off killing, you know, FBI agents and cops, you know, who all try to, who all end up, you know, kind of going, you know, you know, basically tailing him or, or you know, suspecting him of doing of doing this. That's kind of crossing the line, you know. That's you know, killing. I understand there are probably some police officers out there that are probably not that good, you know. There, you know, there, there are some, there are some crooked cops out there. But he's killing those who are just, you know, good, or actually good people. The same kind of people that he wants his world to be, be, be filled with. You know, to be filled with those good people, he's willing to actually kill them off. And that's just wrong, you know. Now, Lelouch goes in about kind of wanting to create a new world as well. Wants to create a peaceful world, you know, as well. One without prejudice or, you know, or, you know, any kind of, just... Without without dictatorship or anything, but mostly you know he wants to create a new world for his you know, for his younger sister Nanali, who's who has lost her ability to walk and is also for some reason you know also become blind or you know just or cannot you know just yeah who's become pretty much blind. Well, you'll understand you know the reason behind that later, so I don't want to spoil anything for you right now. But yeah. He wants to go about it in that way, but Light kind of goes about it in a di in a different style, where he kind of where he understands that he is kind of playing the villain at this point. You know, whereas Light believes he's doing good. You know, that's that's the big thing. Light believes he's doing good, even though he's actually doing wrong. Where Lelouch understands what he's doing, you know, and how and the way that he goes about it. He understands that he's doing that he is playing the villain in, in a way. You know, going, going against you know his own empire and kind of, and sometimes you know, sometimes sacrificing lives, but he shows remorse for it. You know, sometimes he, sometimes when innocent lives get get killed, he shows remorse. He shows sadness. Light only pretends to show sadness. So like when his, uh, well, I don't I don't want to spoil for it, but there's one part where he does he does cry, but. But he's only faking it. He only, he only, he only, he acts it out. He acts it out pretty well, but he's faking it in the end. He doesn't really care. He's just, 
He's just caring about his own goals. He's caring about what he what he wants. Lelouch tries to put people put the lives of people you know, before his own, but even in the end, their innocent lives do get killed. You know, you know, they do get lost. And he shows sadness for it. He shows remorse. Can't so can't be can't be any more different than that, can it? Well, the big difference is the outcome. And this is where I probably where I am gonna spoil it for you. In the end in the end, Light come when Light gets found out that he is in fact the one using the death note, what does he what does he do? He try he tries to pawn it off on someone else, or he at least he tries to Well, how should I say this? He tries to he tries to make it out like he's still innocent and such, and tries to... And then eventually, when he can't do that, he... What does he do? He runs like a little bitch. He, when he can't take it, he runs away. Whereas Lelouch, in the end, actually dies. You know, well, but, well, Light dies as well, but I won't go into that much. But Lelouch willingly sacrifices himself. He actually sacrifices himself for his pe for the uh, for the Japanese and for the sins of his people. Basically, by becoming, he willingly becomes the focal point for everyone's hate. And eventually, you know, by, by, become, by becoming that way, for, you know, where everyone hates him, you know, Britanni both Britannians and Japanese alike, you know, everyone starts to dislike him. You know. He he only he only pretends to play the villain, but in fact, he willingly sacrifices himself for you know for for everyone for the for the world, so it can be a peaceful place at last. So, in the end, Lelouch was a good person. He was a real he was a true hero, who only pretended to be the villain. Whereas Light was was a villain, only pretending to be a good person. They are so there are some so I guess there are some similar so like I said there are some similarities but in the end you know they can't they couldn't be more different you know Lelouch was a caring person willing to willing to sacrifice himself White was just a selfish prick only caring about his own about his own well being and only caring about being the god of a new world Lelouch didn't want to be a god he just wanted a peaceful world. Even if it meant it meant him dying in the end. So yeah, that's about all I can say. I could I can compare these two without completely spoiling anything for you. I was just watching both animes. They're both pretty good, though I think Code Geass is better. Both versions of Code Geass are better than Death Note, but they're both great animes. So anyway, that's all. This is Albedo 238. Signing off.